my god, I swear I always start these videos in my pyjamas, bedhead. So I've been doing some big clear outs of my stuff recently. I feel like I have so much of it. And one of my goals for this year, so random, but was to like everything in my wardrobe. And I feel like that's quite a big thing. I feel like a lot of us have so many things in our wardrobe that are purely for sentimental reasons because we think we might wear it one day. And I do have a couple of those things which I will be keeping. But I feel like I only did this a couple weeks ago, but I feel like I need to go through it all. I've got a ton of stuff that I've already had on Vinted. I've sold a few bits already. And let's just go through it because it needs it. Hey babies. I did actually get rid of three bin bags of clothes. Um, not that long ago. A lot of it was like jeans, jumpers, that kind of thing that just didn't fit me. I was holding on to jeans that were uncomfortable, that didn't fit, and I was like, why am I keeping them? Um, so they're gone. Box of stuff oh, with things that I'm selling, which when you're watching this may be like already gone. I'm gonna be honest, I don't think there's much in my wardrobe now that I will be getting rid of, but this is like my last go. It's the last look. It's the last attempt, trying to figure out if it's staying or going. So this is the wintry stuff, so I feel like this is the most fitting. It's actually not, it's all the long sleeve stuff, but it's mostly winter. Some of this is new, so that will obviously be staying. I'm gonna get out the new stuff, literally in my dressing gown. It is freezing today. Got down to four degrees this morning. I'm sorry, but it was 23 two days ago. I don't know why I'm getting everything out, but here, here we go. I'm obsessed with. I got it from Urban and it is so, so nice on. You may have seen it in a haul if I've uploaded that haul yet. I actually have no idea. Also new, these two are new. A little like cropped, little cropped number and just a full length one. Right, I think everything else is in the possibility to be going. My hair's a bit greasy too, but we're going to ignore that. I have actually got a basket of clothes down here, but I'm pretty sure everything in that basket is going to be a keep because I've worn it. Okay, so in here we do have a couple summer bits, which I am keeping, which I will take out now. These are the summer bits. These are definite keeps because I wear them. Right, so I have this thing with this denim jacket. I've got an oversized one and I've got like a normal size one and I think I need them both. So I'm going to keep it. A little bit longer and this jacket is one of those things it's an occasional wear but I got it at a charity shop and I love it okay, this I literally haven't worn in so long like I don't think I wore it last year maybe even the year before that I think I maybe wore it once actually but this was an old jumper of my dad's but I'm just gonna get rid of it because I don't think I'm gonna wear it and I think it's a waste keeping it I'm gonna get rid of this cardigan I literally love it but I just don't wear it because I don't like how tight it is on the arms. So pretty. I feel like these just aren't me. I used to wear them a lot, like tucked into jeans. But I feel like this just isn't a me thing. This In the summer, yeah, but for winter, I just don't think this is such a shame because this is so soft. I just don't see myself wearing it in the winter. I just don't wear them. Right, this is a sweatshirt, which is a keep because it's great for dancing in and I might not be wearing it loads right now but if, if I'm at drama school this time next year I will be wearing it into my little shelves shelves of rubbish okay I've got this is a keep this is a black knitted jumper from Wednesday's girl I feel like it's an essential and the more I've worn it the more loose the materials got so it feels really nice now same with this black cardigan I feel like you do just need a basic black cardigan and I do wear it Okay, this is now where it gets a bit hard because this is such a good layering piece because it's cropped. Um, but, so that one's cropped. But I have just bought this roll neck. Now I know they're very different. This one's like a full length tuck in and also the neck kind of sticks out more. It's like more of an obvious neck. Whereas this is kind of more of like a fashionable piece. Like this looks really good sitting with jeans. Whereas this is just like a throw under a jumper. So I feel like I should keep both of them. 
Right, then I've got this, which is a bodysuit. Again, I keep it for layering, but I love this neckline. And I think this is a really good layering piece because you then don't, like if I've got a jumper on where I don't want to see a roll neck, this will work. And I don't have many of them, so this is like a really, I wore this literally every day last year. Is one of those things that actually isn't very fashionable, and I put it on and I literally look like a grandma. But I actually really love it. It's just so cosy. I love the pockets, they're really convenient. And it is just cosy. So I am going to keep that. Hey May, it's okay, it's just gracie. It's just gracie. Okay, this I am going to get rid of, which is a shame because it's actually so soft, but I don't feel like it suits me. Um, maybe if my hair was blonder, but it's not. It's winter, my hair is darker. <sighs> now, these tops I am really undecided about because they I love them with skinny jeans, but I don't own any skinny jeans <laughs> anymore. And... Yeah, I think I'm going to keep the green one and get rid of the red one because the green one I can imagine with another, well maybe it wouldn't work. I'm going to set these aside and I'm going to try these on with some jeans later because I'm undecided on them. Yes, I like this bodysuit, I will be keeping that. It's a jumper I bought last year and I think I need to try it on again to decide because it's quite like a big big cosy jumper and I really love the neckline and the colour actually but I need to try it on with different jeans I think. This cardigan I purely have to wear with this brown bodysuit. I don't wear it with anything else but I think that's a bit silly but my thing is is I only wear this in winter and I only wear it when I need a cardigan. So I don't know whether to keep it or not. You know what, I'm not going to keep it purely for one thing. I actually bought this off of um, Emily Louise on Instagram. But I just don't think I'm going to get the wear out of it. This is another basic which actually is quite nice. It looks a bit gross on here. But it's a good basic, it's quite warm. Um, that's from Primark. This again I need to try on. This is a couple years old. It's from H&M a few years ago and I really love this neckline but again I just need to try it on because the bottom's a bit like a funny shape. Um, the sleeves are like balloon sleeves which I do love but I'm not sure if that's the vibe this year. I don't know. I haven't decided. I'm gonna keep this because I wear it on like nicer occasions but this bit is a little bit big for me but I do love it and I do sometimes still wear it. This is a keep because it goes with all my summer dresses. And this is a keep because it goes with all my summer dresses. Okay, you can't actually see, but I do have a ton of like jumpers there, but I've already gone through them and they are staying. Okay. I feel like I should put this pile of clothes away and then maybe I should finish off this video. Rainbow goodness is obviously a keep. I bought this in like spring this year and I've already worn it so much. I feel like I'm not gonna wear it as much in winter though. I feel like it is like a spring, spring kind of thing. This is actually another new top I've got from ASOS, I love it. Okay, now I know this is where I'm not gonna really be able to get rid of much. Um, yeah, it's um, an issue actually. Okay, now this I have literally had forever and never worn, but I'm saving it for if I get into drama school because this it would be so cool for commercial with like a black bra and just like, I don't know, cool trousers or hot pants and fishnets. Um, that's a keep, the basic black top because I bought it as a replacement for this one. This is my Shein one. Um, and it's just gone so gross. They were staples for like a good year, two years, but it's time for them to go. They've just started to get a little bit old, a little bit shriveled, um, and it's just time. Um, this is just a basic black strappy top from Primark, which I wear all the time. A little slinky thing. 
which I don't wear often but it's there for the occasion it's like a going out clubbing kind of thing and I don't do that I don't have many t-shirts so I need this and I love it this is a keep this is actually from Shein but it's like a cotton and I wear this at least every week okay this is going it's had its run it's time to go so long farewell this again is one of those things that I keep because it's so pretty I just don't have many occasions for it but I have to save it this top again I'm saving it for like a really good interview because it's beautiful like look at that back it's stunning so I have to save it this is a new piece I'm putting this in my pajamas because that is I wear that with joggers but never out though it doesn't actually fit me that great it fits the first time I wear it and then the second time it's really loose I keep for one thing and I don't know if it's time to get rid of that one thing I feel like it might be I don't know because I only wear this top with a specific pair of shorts but I don't know if it's time to get rid of those shorts okay this top I need to try on because it looks absolutely tiny and I don't even know if I will fit in it so that's a try on it's a try on I probably haven't worn it in like three years either this I love and I save for the right moment and it's coming it is coming I love it I love it. this is a new piece I got from a charity shop this I love white t-shirt this I love for a specific pair of trousers this is going on. This is staying. Right. Trousers. These are some black flares which I'll keep. Yeah, keep, 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 keep. These are those things that are there for the perfect occasion. I got these for freshers last year and they were perfect. And then my friend Isabel had a like flower power, is it 80s kind of themed birthday? So these were perfect for that and I feel so cool in them. These are like my favourite trousers ever. These are perfect for holidays. White, lovely. Don't wear that often, but I love when I wear them. This skirt is something that I need to try on because I flipping love it, but I never wear it. I really don't want to do this. Right, there's two things I know I'm getting rid of. The jumpsuits. I feel so cool in them. I only wore it this year for an interview. And I just, they're just inconvenient. I used to love play suits, but, because they're convenient in the fact that they're shorts and like you're not gonna flash anyone. But then if you need to go to the toilet, you have to fully strip off. And I just can't be bothered. I just can't be bothered with that. Right, these three are new this year and they are my beautiful babies. Uh, this is literally by a brand called Frolic and it's literally a dress you would frolic in a field in and I am obsessed with it I only got the chance to wear it once on holiday this is from Stradivarius and I literally feel so beautiful in it I love it this is throw on summer dress of dreams it's beautiful the back you like it's got like a double tie that's so nice the color is nice I don't need a bra it's amazing perfect for the hot weather so that is a keep um, I've only worn it twice because it's one of those kind of things. I bought it for my nan's wedding and then I wore it for my birthday and someone actually complimented me on my birthday, which was really nice. This is a keep. I love this dress. Dresses are just for me. This I need to try on. This is a jumpsuit, which I like adjusted all the straps and everything. Oh my God, it's even ironed. Um, but I haven't worn it this year. Maybe try it on with some sandals or something. Okay, here's another dress that needs a try on. This is an old dress, um, and I feel like I probably will never wear it again, but it's one of those things that I have, like, an actual love for. Um, so I'm gonna need to try it on, because I actually do love it, but I think I'm probably gonna have to get rid of it. This dress, I'm pretty sure, is a keep. The only thing is, I don't know when I'm actually gonna wear it next. It's cute. I like it. These are two I need to try on. I bought these last year. They're both from Misguided. Um, they're just quite big. Like, they're size fours, and I am in no way a size four. Like, I would probably be an eight most of the time. Every now and again, I might get into a six. Okay, this dress is a six, to be fair, but this is a four, and like, 
but the shoulders on both of them are really big so I'm gonna try them on um, and see because I do actually really especially this I love this but I'm pretty sure I had to sew it onto a bra when I wore it to stop it falling down and I just can't be bothered with that if that's how it's gonna fit this is a keep even though it's actually made a bit dodgy and doesn't fit me great I wear it all the time so it's a keep this again I bought this year but I need to try it on because I think these are a little bit big so it could be that I just put a little stitch in this is a dress I actually do end up wearing every year even though I say I won't and I'll get rid of it I actually just wear it all the time it's a Bowdoin dress um, which my mum had and it was like a midi dress and we've had it chopped to be short okay now this is where it's going to get tricky because these two are basically the same thing so i've got this dress which is an open back or this play suit now i bought this play suit on holiday and i really really love it obviously though i will have to strip off when i wear it whereas this i don't have to strip off but it really creases I think I'm going to get rid of the dress and keep the play suit. I did only buy this dress this year, but it's just not quite right. Oh, this is when it gets tricky. Okay, so we've got another of these little skater dresses. I got this from Amy. And I really like the dress and I did wear it, but now I'm not sure if I am going to wear it. I've got another black dress I prefer. So that's going to go. Okay, this is a nighty, but I wear it out. It's cool for photo shoots as well. That I need to try on, I wore for my 18th. Um, but I love it. My funeral dress, so that'll stay. This is a cute little thing for Christmas. I've actually worn this two Christmases in a row and I kind of want to wear it again, but I feel like that's overkill. But I'm gonna keep it because I flipping love it. Sparkles of Dreams, which actually I might wear this Christmas. I love this, this is from Topshop. And then I've got my prom dress which I actually have no idea if it fits me and I should probably sell it. So I'm gonna try these on maybe later today um, and then I'll be able to finish up. But I've got nearly another bin bag worth of stuff that I've got rid of. Maybe not a full bin bag, but nearly. But this, this could be going, this could be staying. These are the jeans that I typically would be wearing during autumn winter. These are from Stradivarius. So we've got the red top from Wednesday's Girl, but it looks horrid, it looks horrid. It just doesn't look right with these jeans. It needs skinny jeans, so that's a no. See, I kind of love this top. This one fits a little bit tighter on the top. I just don't see myself wearing it. It just doesn't look as flattering as it used to, especially now I don't really wear like proper bras. It just doesn't look right. Like, I feel like I just look gross. This is a brand called William Rust that I got from TK Maxx. Um, I do love this jumper. I wore it loads last year. Yeah, I'm gonna keep that. I really like the neckline on this. It's just very chilled, um, very comfy. This is a H&M jumper. I think I got this like two years ago, maybe, maybe three. Yeah, this is a keep. I feel like this is just really good for autumn. It's a, it's a big jumper, but it's still kind of gives a little bit of shape. Okay, so ignoring the top because the top is was never an, op an option not to keep. The score I think is super cute. I just don't have like a reason to wear it. Um, it has got like shorts underneath, so you're not gonna flash. I feel like it's great for if I ever need it. And I feel like it's one of those things I could need if I do end up going into musical theatre. I don't know what I'd pair it with. Although this really gives me like American private school like 2000s kind of movie <laughs> yeah it's a keep it's a keep for keeping skirt see i love this for my 18th but i just don't love it now so this is going i was obsessed with this i nearly bought it in like five other colors it's also really stretchy at the back like look madness sometimes i step into dresses and i can literally hear it ripping as i step into it and i still do it anyway I never know how these should tie because one's always really short and one's always really long. Oh, well, that's kind of worked. See, my thing with this dress is I think it's so pretty. I think it's such a pretty dress. But there's so much material over this bit. 
it feels so warm so it's kind of oh, let me show you so because of the material it's like this brodery kind of thing but then it's got another layer and then it's got that and another layer so all around here like your stomach is really hot and it is lined which is really nice but it feels warm and I remember on holiday I was feeling quite sweaty I also feel like the back isn't it doesn't fit me the best so I think I'm gonna sell this so I'm just not I know I'm not gonna get the wear out of it I thought it was my perfect white dress it just it wasn't so I bought this dress last year for my 19th see oh, I do like oh, a mixed opinions because I really like it from like here down but I don't like how broad it makes my shoulders look um I feel like it makes my shoulders look really broad it's a really nice length though this is from misguided by the way but yeah I don't like the top so I'm gonna sell this this dress um I got it out my wardrobe and look it's got all of these weird marks on them and we don't know what it is like it doesn't smell and I don't know if this was here months ago or if it happened since I've taken out my wardrobe so I'm going to look back at the footage on here and see if I can see anything but um I'm just not going to keep it because it w I knew it was a little bit big anyway even though it's a four and if it's stained I just think what's the point oh I was really hoping I wouldn't like this dress because I've literally had it for years but I just love this style dress on me I feel so nice in it but I feel like I I don't know if it makes me look young but I feel like with a nice pair of like white heels this could actually be really cute for like I don't know a summer wedding maybe or like I actually don't know I just really like it I just don't know when I'm gonna wear it it's really flattering let me try it without the bra I just think it's really flattering I'm gonna go ask my mum okay mum seems to think I can dress this down which I feel like I would have to try I do really like it I need to tighten the straps a little bit I think I've shrunk since I last wore this but I just love it so this is from new look years ago um I just love it I love love it Okay, so this one is kind of handmade because I adjusted the straps, although I think I could probably have done them a little bit tighter because they do kind of slide. Maybe I need to pull this down a bit. I'm always scared of expose exposing myself. My nipples are literally like not even there. Right. <laughs> I really like this. I think it's quite nice for my... Mm, actually, maybe I don't like it. Okay, I like it when it's pulled up here because it sits quite at a nice place on my waist but when it's like this the straps are too big what's it like without straps oh that is cute but I feel like it's a little bit short because I've got long legs I think it's just too short oh that's such a shame because I r literally really like it see it's such a nice jumpsuit because it really like elongates your body it's really flattering but it's just a little bit too short but if I made it into Oh god no that's hideous i only got this last year and i wore it in edinburgh like on a day out and it was so nice but i think it's just not right now unfortunately this video probably won't be up for ages and it's currently like the 25th of september so you're probably watching this in like november um <laughs> anyway i hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you guys very soon with another video bye